Israel launched a number of airstrikes and ground raids against a refugee camp in the Palestinian city of Jenin, killing at least eight people and wounding 50 more. This is the largest airstrike in the West Bank since the end of the Second Intifada, a major Palestinian uprising against Israel in 2006. The Israeli army said it's targeting alleged terrorist infrastructure belonging to a militant group in the camp known as the Jenin Brigade. Palestinian Prime Minister Mohammed Shteya called the operation a new attempt to destroy the camp and displace its people. The West Bank has been under occupation by Israel since 1967. The Jenin refugee camp was created to house some of the many Palestinian refugees displaced from their homes in 1960. 48 to make way for the creation of the state of Israel. The camp is densely populated with over 14,000 people living within 0.16 square miles. Palestinian officials said that the destruction of roads in the camp by the Israeli army has made it difficult for ambulances to enter. The Red Crescent Society urgently called for a safe passage to evacuate the wounded and injured. This airstrike has occurred amidst a rise in violence in the West Bank, including another drone strike in Jenin on June 20th and increased settler attacks on Palestinian villages. An Israeli army spokesperson told the BBC that this operation could last for days and that 2,000 Israeli troops are being deployed to Jenin.